yesterday was the Super Bowl, and so some pretty interesting things that I saw. Taylor Swift, Travis Kelsey, and then all the celebrities that they always love to turn to. And I have me thinking, our celebrities in the United States are just a bunch of losers. Now let's contrast that with Israel. And I love to turn to Israel because they're, they're basically role models to the world. They have TV, TV stars, they have their own TV. And so who are their stars? This guy named Idan, I can't remember his last name, but he's a famous actor from the TV show called Fauda. And it was probably very popular in the United States. And he's not religious, but where I started, October 7th, he picked up a gun, he fought in Gaza, he got seriously injured, and he, 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 he pushed through the injury. And week, two weeks later, he was on camera with you know bandages and, and all wounded over his face. And he gave this very powerful speech saying, we're going we're gonna to survive and we're going to make it and things like that. I don't know if he got back onto the TV show because he could be he was too injured to actually act. But it made me realize that when you start looking at the stars, there's a singer called Akiva in Israel, and he put out a video after October 7th, it was like three weeks after October 7th, he's like, he started singing his own song, and he says, I'm going to serve now in Gaza. It was just videoing, and this is a famous singer. These are famous people. These are like Taylor Swift level people inside of Israel. And they're going to serve to fight for their country and defend every single citizen, right? They they all know someone who was affected by October 7th. Again, Israel's a very small country. And so they're all going to fight. And you have more celebrities and more celebrities, and they're all on the front lines. And it was very interesting to see. And you think, like, Taylor Swift, will you ever see her in a billion years going to serve in, in, in the American army, fighting against whatever battle we had to fight? Of course not. Our celebrities, they get passes. You don't have to. You're good. And again, I just want to put, put this out there for all those people that keep on saying, okay, so you join if you really want war. I'd just like to point out, I tried three times. I did not qualify. I have bad knees. Stop asking. I really want to. I tried. Uh, but, but I digress. If we go through the list, right? The list of people you have our you have our you have our NFL players and and those are people who like to but they're they're drug addicts they're they're they're, they're they get angry all the time they get drunk at, at 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 Vegas they get all these bad things they get pulled over for DUIs and yes there's some good ones right the the kicker for the Chiefs he is what the fuck is his name can't remember his name but he's he he goes to church and he's very pro God and he's you know he wears the nice suit and he's He's, he, he shows, like, you want to look up to him. But for the most part, that is not true. Right? You have, like, I Spice who sat next to Taylor Swift, and she's literally shaking her behind for the world to see. And it's like, ooh, that's a role model for our children. And in Israel, their role models are picking up a gun and saying, I'm going to fight for my country. And this, these are massive celebrities. You have to understand that. These are really big celebrities. And I'm not saying that they're perfect, right? Obviously, I'm not saying that. But you have everyone every famous person says, go pick up the gun we're going to gaza right? hundreds of thousands of people i don't see that happening in the united states and we need to switch that we need to turn that different you know ben shapiro put out the rap song and it was very interesting because for a second for people like this just for one second and it was gone he became this kind of ooh for millions of americans who otherwise would be listening to Nicki minaj or Taylor Swift or whoever they were listening to or I Spice, right? They did watch that video. They might not admit it to you, but they did see the video or they saw someone watching the video, right? They they saw someone reviewing it. They definitely saw it somewhere. They heard it somewhere. And so that's what we need to get to is with celebrities not trying to get you to do drugs, not trying to get you to, you know, be citizens? No. Licentious. There we go. I think that's the word. And like I said in the previous video, I'm feeling good. And that's what we need to get back to. And America used to have that, right? America of old, that's what celebrity status was. Like you have like, I was like thinking about Abraham Lincoln, who is like, he's a boxer, he's a debater, he's a skinny guy, children liked him, you know, all the, all the good things. But he was also a little bit weird and, and kind of like those type of people we have to start looking up to. Like George Washington, I know he owns slaves. like everyone else in the world at that time like literally everyone owned slaves if you could afford it 
of course he was terrible um, and then he set them free but uh, right people like that we're, we're moving away from that like who do we have Joe Biden he, our president of the United States he's a thief everyone knows he's a thief like even if you vote for him you still know you know you're voting for a thief you're just saying I'm gonna vote for him because I'm voting Democrat I don't want to vote for Donald Trump and on the other side like Donald Trump is he he our role model that guy is more disgusting than like a pack of thieves and so we're, we're losing just people to look up to and so all our children see are just these narcissistic terrible people and well look how Israel society is turning out and right they're becoming a global hegemon and they're making billions of dollars and their, their their society is one of the happiest in the world and everyone is connected and familial and everything is great and in America everything's destroyed we're losing your money our economy is trash crime is rampant in all our streets and everything is just going <laughs> love that sound effect and so we have to change that's all I'm saying please change subscribe also change and like and leave comments ton of comments there's like a thousand comments find 10,000 comments just if you find like half a comment and then you think fine see you next video okay stop being so, so you don't have to leave a comment